Ethereum could make another all-time high because we are forming bullish patterns. In this video, you will find out what Ethereum is going to do next. Welcome to Daily Crypto Technical Analysis. We are going to do daily Ethereum price prediction for intraday trading using different indicators and of course, price action. But before we start, smash the like button because today's goal is to reach 300 likes on this video. Make sure it turns blue. It will only take you one second. On the hourly time frame right now on Ethereum, you are going to see that once again, we pull to the downside to around 1,645 US dollars. Because of that right now, Ethereum unfortunately invalidated our double bottom pattern and our double bottoms pattern target was around 1,800 US dollars. Because right now, Bitcoin price pulled back below our support level at around 1,681 US dollars, our double bottom pattern and also our target at around 1,800 US dollars unfortunately got invalidated. In yesterday's video, I was also talking about the symmetrical triangle that Ethereum was forming. And right now you can definitely clearly see that we broke our symmetrical triangle to the upside, we got a bullish retest and once again pulled to the upside. But our price target of our symmetrical triangle still has not been reached. Our price target of our symmetrical triangle here on the Ethereum price would be once again at around 1,800 US dollars. And because of that right now, I would still say Ethereum is looking bullish and I would be expecting more movement to the upside in the next couple of hours, in the next couple of days. I'm going to give you a trading idea where you could be looking to go with another long position on Ethereum if a specific level right now is actually going to get broken. Right now on Ethereum, you can definitely see we are making higher lows and also higher highs. And because of that, it does look like Ethereum is forming some kind of the ascending channel. And this ascending channel right now, it does look like the bottoms are very nicely respected and also the tops right here are very nicely respected. And also you can see the middle line of this ascending channel, it looks like Ethereum got rejected almost perfectly off of it. But in this ascending channel, you can definitely once again see that Ethereum is also making lower highs right here and also lower lows. And because that it does look like we are forming a bull flag in this ascending channel. And because that right now, if Ethereum is going to see a pull to the downside to our diagonal support level, which is right now forming this ascending channel, that means if we are going to see a pull to the downside, then of course we could bounce right here, some kind of a double bottom pattern, and then hopefully once again, pull to the upside. Our price target of this bull flag could actually be measured from the bull flag to the bottom right here. And if we put the trend line at the breakout around here, you can definitely see our price target could be around 1,796 US dollars. Because right now our symmetrical triangle target would also be around 1,800 US dollars and also right now our bull flags target is also around 1,800 US dollars in my opinion, Ethereum could actually see a pull to the upside to around 1,800 US dollars in the next couple of hours if our bull flag is going to get broken to the upside. But you can also clearly see that our top of our SNE channel, it's not actually going to be reached. Because of that, you could actually be looking to take some profits at around 1,800 US dollars and then maybe ride the wave to the upside to our diagonal resistance level, which is then forming this SNE channel, which could right now be around 1,830 US dollars. So those are right now my bullish targets for Ethereum. But where could you actually be looking to go with a long position? That means right now that if, if Ethereum is going to break this very specific diagonal resistance level, that means that our bull flag is going to get broken to the upside. Here, you could actually be looking to go with a long position on Ethereum. Stop loss could be in the bull flag or also maybe even better below our diagonal support level from this SNE channel here on the Ethereum price. Right now, you can also see that a volume is right now confirming us that a breakout out of the SNE channel to the downside or maybe breakout out of the bull flag, of course, right now is imminent. Why? Because you can clearly see volume is descending right now. Volume is decreasing to the downside. And because of that, I would just like to say, in my opinion, breakout on Ethereum is definitely imminent. Yes, because this is right now a bull flag, we are having the higher probability of breaking to the upside. And our bull flag actually breaks to the upside usually on the fourth three test of the upper trend line. So we got a pull to the upside, pull down, pull up, pull down. And right now, of course, you can clearly see maybe a pull to the downside to our diagonal support level right here. And then on the fourth three test of the upper diagonal resistance level, I would definitely be expecting a breakout to the upside out of the bull flag right now. And yes, hopefully volume is also going to confirm us a breakout out of the bull flag to the upside. And then of course, ride the wave to the upside. As I said before, our next price target would be around 1,800. 
800 US dollars. But what if right now Ethereum is going to break our bull flag to the downside? And also what if we are going to break our SNE channel to the downside? Where would be my next price target for Ethereum where you could potentially be looking to go with another long position? Because you can clearly see our previous low on Ethereum was around here. Our previous high was exactly right here. Because of that, our 1,574 US dollars right now is a key level for Ethereum where we are having our horizontal support level. And also, why is this very specific level so important for Ethereum? Because if we go on the 4 hour time frame and if we go with our diagonal support level, I was already mentioning this very important diagonal support level already many times on my videos and also in my live streams. Right now, you can definitely see our diagonal support level right now is almost perfectly aligning with our horizontal support level. And also, if you would go with exponential moving averages on the three hourly time frame, it does look like our 50 exponential moving average is also coming to the upside and it's most probably then going to align with our diagonal support level, horizontal support level. And also, of course, then we are going to have our 50 exponential moving average exactly right here. Because of that, if Ethereum right now is going to break our SNE channel to the downside, we would have a pretty high probability of bouncing right there and then of course hopefully continuing our way to the upside and also right now if we go back on the four hour time frame and measure the entire move to the upside from swing low to swing high you can definitely right now see we are having our 0.382 fibonacci level exactly at around 1574 us dollars and because of that right now if ethereum is going to see a pull to the downside in the next couple of hours here we would actually have a very high probability of bouncing and then hopefully continuing our way to the upside if you haven't already, you need to see my Bitcoin price prediction video because I was saying in Bitcoin price prediction video that we could potentially see a big pull to the downside. And if Bitcoin is going to see a pull to the downside, of course, Ethereum could actually follow. But purely looking right now at Ethereum, you can clearly see here we are having multiple points right here at around 1,575 US dollars while Ethereum could bounce here and then of course continue its way to the upside. Right now, before I actually show you a bullish indication for Ethereum, which is going to be confirmed in our around one day, if you are not already leverage trading Bitcoin and Ethereum on Bybit leverage trading exchange, I have below the like button links where you can sign up on Bybit and get up to $90 for free in trading bonus if you are going to use this very specific link down below in the description below the like button. Right now, if we go on a weekly time frame for Ethereum, you are definitely going to see that we are forming a very nice bullish weekly candle right here. And if this specific candle is going to close something like this in around one day and 13 hours, of course, it is going to be a very nice and bullish indication for Ethereum why we could actually continue our way to the upside. Of course, on Bitcoin, we are also forming a very nice bullish candle right here. So hopefully, if those candles are going to close something like this in around one day and 13 hours, it would be a bullish indication for Ethereum. But right now, if we actually go on a daily time frame, you are going to see that on the RSI indicator, we could be getting a potential bearish divergence. It does look like, of course, Ethereum is forming higher highs, but we are forming on the RSI indicator lower highs. Because of that, we are having our RSI bearish diverging. So we are making higher highs or all-time highs on the Ethereum, but we are making lower highs on the RSI indicator. We are having a bearish divergence on a daily time frame right now on the RSI indicator, on the Ethereum price, and also on the four-hour time frame, of course. Bearish divergence right here. Lower high on the RSI indicator, higher high on the price action of Ethereum. Exactly the same thing is happening on the three hourly time frame and also on the uh, on the two hourly time frame. We are forming lower highs on the RSI indicator and we are forming higher highs or, or, or all time highs on the Ethereum price action. And because of that, I just want to say right now, it is a bearish indication for Ethereum why potentially we could see more movement to the downside in the next couple of days. But because I usually say price action first, indicator second, we are definitely right now in the uptrend. We are forming a bullish pattern right here and because that if I would go with the probabilities I would still say Ethereum is looking bullish and I would be expecting up a potential new all-time high being formed here on the Ethereum price. Also right now, if we go once again with our RSI indicator, it does look like we are bouncing perfectly at our 50 level right here on the RSI indicator. This specific level is acting as our support level. We could once again bounce here, continuing our way to the upside. Exactly the same thing is happening on the three hour time frame on the relative strength index. It does look like we are bouncing at our 55 level right here on the RSI indicator. And because that once again, a bullish indication for Ethereum, why we could definitely right now continue our way to the upside here on the Ethereum price. 
Yes, it is true. We are forming bearish divergences on multiple time frames on multiple indicators right now. But because right now price action first indicator second, because we are definitely in the bull market right now, Ethereum, in my opinion, still looks nice and bullish. And you could be expecting more movement to the upside in the next couple of hours. And hopefully then, of course, our bull flag is also going to get broken to the upside. Right now, if we go with our money flow indicator, once again, it does look like we could be forming a bearish divergence right here. Lower high on the money flow indicator, higher high on the price action of Ethereum. It is a bearish divergence right here. Also on the wave trend indicator right now on the three hourly time frame, it does look like we web it's curving to the upside on the three hourly. Also, if you would go on the four hourly time frame, it does look like we web it's curving to the upside. Because of that, if we are going to get a green dot right there on the three hourly and also on the four hourly time frame on the wave trend indicator, of course, it would be a bullish indication for Ethereum. And I would be expecting then that the bull fact right here is actually going to get broken to the upside. As I said before, our next price target would be around 1,800 US dollars. Your next price target could actually be the diagonal resistance level from this ascending channel, which could be around 1,830 US dollars here on the Ethereum price. Also right now, if we go with our MACD indicator on the hourly time frame, it does look like we could be forming a potential bullish divergence. Lower low on the MACD indicator, higher low on the price action of Ethereum. It is a bullish divergence right now for the Ethereum price. And because of that, yes, you could be expecting the bull flag right there to actually be broken to the upside here on the Ethereum price in the next couple of hours. If you haven't already, please do smash a like button because today's goal is to reach 300 likes on this video. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel because I'm uploading daily Bitcoin and Ethereum price predictions and technical analysis videos. Right now, you can watch one of those two videos that are popping up on your screen. Thank you for watching and peace out.